our Irish farmhouse. Just wanted to share with you a little fun project that we just been working on and that's getting our home prayer corner together and uh, just wanted to share with you some ideas that you can have if you guys are trying to create a prayer corner of your own or thinking about it and um, just wanted to say if you're thinking about it you should do it because um, ours is in our our master bedroom because this is a small cabin and we don't really have other places for it to be but um, it's a good place for it somewhere where it's quiet and as it says in the Bible I was saying you know go into your room lock the door and pray to your father in secret and your father who hears you in secret will hear your prayer it's so beautiful and so you know, and in addition to having a home altar, having a home prayer corner is so special and you are gonna use it all the time. So my husband requested um, me to make one at our old house and um, I did. I didn't think I was gonna use it that much because I kind of have my own routine, but I used it all the time. So it's a really, really beautiful idea. And once you have it there, is so inviting to go and just pray at the prayer corner and just spend some time reflecting when you have a quiet moment through your day and um, talking with Jesus and so just wanted to share that with you and give you some ideas so here's our prayer corner it's kind of hard to take this video because it's a tight little corner in our cabin got a nice window outside we have a nice comfy chair with some pillows and um, of course first the picture of the sacred heart of Jesus and um, then a statue of Our Lady with uh, the infant Jesus and we've got a little um, tiered tower thing that has rosaries in it um, of course some holy water and um, just some little plants and uh, then you know a light and on this board though is what I wanted to kind of point out is we have a, a it's like a pin board and you put your prayers you know when you leave your you know your prayer time or if you're just thinking about it through the day you can write your little intentions on a little piece of paper so we've got a little pen and papers over here that'll be here and you can write it and you just pin it on the pin board and Anybody could do it, your kids, anybody, and just leave the intentions there in the prayer corner um, throughout the days. And it's just something that everybody knows the family or individuals are personally praying for, and you can kind of offer them up all the time um, by having them here. I mean, I guess you could put little envelopes if you didn't want them to be seen, but you know, I don't know. It's kind of a family prayer corner. So however you'd like to do that, but, um, yeah, just, just a beautiful idea to kind of encourage more um, involvement with the prayer corner and to see, you know, what you're praying together as a family and such like that. So we've also got some religious books down here and um, some children's books, children's religious books like the Catholic prayer book for children and the mass for children. and. Our little guy has already wanted to come over and and um, taken a peek at the prayer books and wanted to say some prayers and so it's really inviting once you have it for everyone to want to come and pray and you're going to be I'm sure surprised of how much you guys are going to use it and so I just took a pin board from Goodwill and found some curtain and material a heavyweight curtain and I just um, tacked it on there to, you know to make it like kind of match your surroundings and such and a little board that you know faith family and friends just some decor which you know I love to do but you can have a lot of fun with it and make it really cozy and inviting um, whatever devotions you guys have you know have them here but having a central spot is really I find or our whole family finds really important and it's just nice to have something that when you have those times throughout the day that if something comes up you can just take a moment and go to the corner and just pray in a really 
um, intentional way. I think that's what is so um, nice and beautiful about having an actual prayer corner for your family. So just wanted to share that with you. Thanks so much for joining today. So again, this is our Irish farmhouse and take care and God bless. Bye-bye.